of the high school softball and baseball state championship series. Let's start for the 1A softball series here at Dale Softball Stadium here at NC State's campus in Raleigh between North Duplin and Union Academy. Game one was tonight. Let's dive right into the action. There was a very big crowd of Rebels in the action in the crowd there tonight. Three fourths of the crowd was North Duplin fans. Bottom of the first, down one to nothing, Casey Jones, one of the two seniors on this roster, tied the game for the Rebels on an RBI single. One to one now. Second inning we go, Union Academy up 2-1. Rebels trying to get more, but check the diving snag by Union Academy's Riley Griffin. What a play. As the full moon started to rise over the stadium, North Duplin would strike back. Addie Higginbotham. Hits a line drive into left. That gets down and scores the tying run at two apiece in the second inning. We've got a game in this one, but top of the third. Here come the Cardinals. Gabby Gamma deep into right for Union Academy. That gets down and scores three runs for the Cardinals to, to take a lead, five to two at that point. Fifth inning we go. Union Academy starting to cruise. Two run homer from Riley Griffin. And the Cardinals from Union Academy shock North Duplin 13 to three in six innings to take game one. Game two is tomorrow at 11 a.m. Win or go home for North Duplin. Let's go to college baseball. The Charlottesville Regional as ECU faced Oklahoma this evening on the diamond for the first time ever. Ace Treya Savage got the start on the mound. Five innings pitched, seven strikeouts, gave up four hits and one run. Five to nothing, Pirates in the fourth, Justin Wilcoxon, a two-run bomb out to right field. That made it seven to nothing, ECU at that point. Then next inning, Carter Cunningham tacks on even more. Deep to right, that gets down at the warning track to score two more for the Pirates. And Josh Moylan would soon follow suit, bringing in another run in the inning. ECU smokes the Sooners in their first ever meeting, 14 to five. ECU will face Virginia tomorrow at 6 p.m. Virginia beat Army today, 15 to one. We just got J.H. Rose baseball highlights in. Let's go to those now. An hour away from Raleigh in Burlington, Rose was taking on West Henderson in the 3A High School Baseball Championship Series at Burlington Athletic Stadium. Andrew Wallace. The UNC commit got the start on the mound for the Rampants, but West Henderson was just the better team today. They get the win by the final of 6-2, to two. so now J.H. Rose do or die for them. Win or go home, game two is tomorrow at 2 p.m. in Burlington. And again, we will have highlights of both of those games. Now North Duplin and J.H. Rose back-to-back. -back, win or go home for them, as well as ECU heading on to face Virginia. Big matchup tomorrow at 6 p.m. We'll have highlights of all of those games in all of our shows tomorrow. But for now, reporting from Raleigh, Brett Kennedy, News Channel 12. And Brett Kennedy will be there in Kinston for the Wood Ducks. Should be a beautiful game. We're going to get rid of those clouds and fog tomorrow morning.